What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Tony Mack. Y'all, you know what it is. You know what I'm saying? Brock Purdy is average. It's at best. Average at best. I'm tired of hearing it. All y'all sports writers, all y'all sports casters who talking about he the next time, Brady, Brock Purdy, Brock Pitty, Brock I. That's what y'all need to start calling him, Brock I. You know what I'm saying? It looked like Christian McCaffrey should have been playing quarterback or something, bro. When the chips was down, when Debo went out, Christian went out, Trent went out, he showed y'all he was a systematic quarterback at best. I don't want to hear it no more. I don't want to hear it no more. I've been trying to tell y'all that all year. That kid has been surrounded by talent. He's been throwing the ball from 5 to 10 yards, and the superstars been taking it the rest of the way. Now when it was down for him to make close throws, for him to stay calm when the score was tight, what did he do? And I'm going to be real with you. I ain't even waiting to see if the Niners won the game or not. I'm just hurrying up to tell the truth about it. Because whether we won or not, we lost a lot today. Christian McCaffrey, injured. Debo Samuel, injured. Greenlaw, didn't play tonight, injured. Uh, Trent Williams, injured. What's going on, man? Does, is it? Do they got a bounty out on us or something? I just, I, I, I don't know. I don't know. You know what? I know what it is. I know exactly what it is. I made too many jokes about the Cowboy fan. I said, God damn, Errol Spence got his ass whooped just like y'all. I made too many of goddamn jokes. And that, that's, it's my fault. I'm sorry, y'all. It's not Brock Purdy's fault. It's my fault because I got carried away. We was up 42 to 10. What would y'all wanted me to do? Well, I was, I had to talk shit. You know how much, if they would have beat us 42 to 10, I'd have had to move to another earth. I moved to the to Venus somewhere. So I had to talk my trash, bro. And and this and and we got humbled today. Win loss a draw. We got humbled today. And the reality, we needed it. The reality of it, we needed it, man. Kyle Shanahan, it's time to mix up your play call. It's time to get better with your schemes. You know, maybe we need to get uh that third wide receiver, third wide receiver, Juwan Jennings. More in the offense. Mix up some things, you know. Let's get Kittle back more dynamic. Throw juice in the offense a little bit, man. We got some good running backs. We got a stable of running backs. You know, I don't know if our offensive line was the rain or anything like that. Was that the problem? But here's the thing, 49er fan, my fellow 49er fans. If we having troubles playing in the rain against the elements, what the hell are we going to do in the playoffs? What are we going to do then? Because everybody's not going to be hosting with, with a beautiful dome, putting your, t your AC on 72 so you can feel cozy. You know what I mean? Everybody's not going to have it like that. If we got to play in Philadelphia, it's going to be snowing. If we got to play in the Cowboy, ain't no telling if you playing out there in Arlington, nigga. It'll rain, sleet, snow, rain, sleet, snow all in the same day. You know, it's damn near like Florida, where the storm looked like a hurricane coming through that motherfucker and be hot the next five minutes, you know? Or you don't know where you're going to go. Or if, let's just say, mm, we host the NFC championship game. Let's say we get home field advantage. You know, we play in the elements, and it's probably going to rain late in the seasons or early next year. It's going to be fucking terrible conditions. So if you telling me y'all can't play in terrible conditions going to, to Cleveland, bro, y'all might as well not even fucking play. And I'm just keeping it real with y'all. I'm not trying to diss, but I am a concerned fan. Last time we won a Super Bowl was in 94. I see y'all wearing them Deion Sanders edition jerseys. Let's hope we can get the spirit of prime time. Merton Hanks, Jerry White, Jerry Wright, Steve Young. Let's see if we can get some of the spirit of them back to wake our ass up because we were supposed to dominate today, and we didn't do that at all. They beat us on every side of the fucking ball, special teams, offense, defense, shit, cheerleading. They fucking nachos was better than ours. I bet you they drink machine was better than ours. Hell, they cheerleaders probably was even thicker. We got our ass whooped at every goddamn element tonight, win or loss, because I, I didn't watch the rest of the game. I didn't even want to see that shit. It looked pathetic. You niggas blew my goddamn high. I'm blaming it on y'all. And most of your fans are in California, so I'm pretty sure you blew theirs too. You sons of bitches. What the hell is going on today, man? 
Is Debo and Christian McCaffrey Batman and fucking Superman for the team? Do we not know how to play football anymore? Come on, Kyle Shanahan. I almost called you a head coach, but you're showing me you're still a fucking offense coordinator. And today, not a good one. What's going on, brother? Come on, man. You're better than that. You're better than that. Let's go get number six, y'all. Let's go get number six, man. Sorry, I'm just a pissed off Niner fan. I don't mean to tell the team, but fuck, somebody got to say it. I'm hoping some Fred Warner, man. You know, I don't need you to be the handsome motherfucker. I need you to go turn up, Nick, turn to Killmonger. You know what I'm saying? Turn up. Somebody need to be in the locker room asking their team, do we have fucking vaginas or not? I'm not saying that's what I think about y'all because I hope to get autographs when I see y'all because I'm not saying that about y'all. I'm saying that's what y'all should be saying about yourselves. This shit was bullshit. Them team, that team was two and three, man. And I won't hear that any given Sunday shit. I don't want to hear it. This is not a Jamie Foxx movie. I do not want to fucking hear it. Not at all. Not at all. Let's get better next week, y'all. Come on. Bang, bang, Niner gang. It's always Tony Mack. It's always real. But it's always love. Come on. Let's do better, y'all. Peace.